I'm Steve Garagiola in for Karen Drew. First at four, Detroit police are looking for clues after a deadly discovery on the city's east side. A young man found shot to death on Waltham Street. It's near East State Fair. Happened at about 8.30 this morning. Police say the victim was 26 years old. Neighbors call him a great guy who would help anyone in need. Emotions out there are running very high. It, it was good. It was just the average kid, you know. He wasn't the greatest. He wasn't the greatest, but he was nice. And he took care. He did what he had to do. For his family. Yes. And he was just so funny. He'd give you anything. So far, police have not shared information on what might have led to that shooting. Their investigation continues. Uh, the UAW trying to show that it's serious about cleaning up corruption within its ranks. The union has launched new financial reforms that include a series of audits. The UAW will hire four additional auditors and a new external auditing firm. They will also expand internal training for workers with financial and accounting duties. The Secretary Treasurer's Office will centralize financial operations. We'll have the first reaction to the changes from business editor Rod Maloney. That's coming up at 5. It's a clear sign of the holiday season in Detroit. The Goodfellows are out selling their special edition newspapers to raise money for needy children. A parade in downtown Detroit kicked off the newspaper sale. The Goodfellows have been in existence since 1914. The group prepares gift packages for children every year. It's not too late to help. You can go to clickondetroit.com and learn how you can make a direct contribution.